Hey, it's Allison. I've been a math teacher for 15 years. Today we're going to talk about converting from inches to centimeters. So what's important to know about this is the conversion factor, how many inches there are in how many centimeters. So there is one inch for every 2.54 centimeters. That's our conversion factor. So what we're going to do is we're going to make this a proportion and then make a little proportion equation and figure it out. So let's say I want to convert 2 inches into centimeters. Well, on one side of the equation, I'm going to have my conversion factor. So for every 1 inch, I have 2.54 centimeters. Okay? And then on the other side, I'm going to have the thing I want to convert, which is my 2 inches and I want to convert it into centimeters. I don't know how many centimeters that is yet. That's what I'm going to figure out. So we have x centimeters on the bottom. Now you can just cross multiply to figure this out. 1 times x is just x. And then we cross multiply this way and we get 2 times 2.54. And 2 times 2.54 is 5.08. So 2 inches is the same as 5.08 centimeters. Now, you can also go the other way. If you have centimeters, you can find out inches. So let's look at that. All right, so again, we have our conversion factor. We have 1 inch for every 2.54 centimeters. Now, let's say I have 7.62 centimeters and I want to convert it to inches. Now, whenever you do a proportion problem, you have to make sure that you put things in the right order. So inches have to be on the top and centimeters have to be on the bottom because that's how I wrote my conversion factor here. So let's say I have 7.62 centimeters and I want to find out how many inches that is. So I have x inches on the top. Again, we're just going to cross multiply. We're going to cross multiply this way. 1 times 7.62 is 7.62. And then we're going to cross multiply this way and we have 2.54 times x. So now to solve for x, I just divide both sides of the equation by 2.54. And 7.62 divided by 2.54 happens to be 3, so 3 inches. So whenever you need to convert inches to centimeters or centimeters to inches, this is how you can do it. You write down your conversion factor, and then you set that equal to what you're trying to convert. But just make sure that your inches and your centimeters are on the same side on both sides of the equation. If you put inches on the top on one side, you have to put inches on the top on the other. And if the centimeters are on the bottom, you've got to keep the centimeters on the bottom. Then you just cross multiply and solve for the thing that you're missing. And that's how you do conversions from inches to centimeters. Thanks for learning with me today. If you want any more information on any of the topics, check out the links below. And if you enjoyed our videos, please like us on Facebook. If you have any specific requests, send them to requests at mahalo.com. I'll see you later.